place I got a Cinnabon um, what else did I get a cookie butter donut you got a lot you had a lemon a lemon blueberry what was your favorite uh probably cookie butter oh, Lem really yeah it was, it was the only one I finished the Cinnabon oh, true. was a little too stale the Cinnabon is <laughs> cinnamon roll was rock hard and I was like trying to take a bite of it and I'm like I literally had to use it like my fork like a pick I was trying to make the best of the situation so I said it was good it was good. You liked it. Yeah. But it needed to be heated up. Um, but it was really good. That place is really good. And it has a ton of vegan options. They had like a vegan maple chai and stuff like that. But I went before with my mom and my grandma. And I didn't get there. Like we went there pretty late in the day. Like AK 10 a.m. or 11. And they were sold out of every vegan donut. So they like sell out really quickly. But Yeah, we went too early though. This time we were there really early. We were too early because they didn't even have the fresh Cinnabons out. Yeah, but they have somebody making cinnamon rolls like in the front room, which is really kind of cool. And she was using Earth Balance butter, which is our favorite butter, which is the only real butter people use. I just got an email saying email hacked. Your email is hacked. Is it from your school? What? Is it from someone like someone pretending to say your school email is hacked or is your actual email? My actual email, but the the t subject of the email, your email is hacked. <laughs> the contents of the email, your email is hacked. Seriously. Anyway, gotta go deal with that. <laughs> Camera like this. Yeah, obviously don't <laughs> Well, guess what? You're making us late. We need to leave no, now. And this not. is what you're doing. Because this is my You weekend. said you were busy. It's the weekend. <gasps> you become really mean when I write on this Because I said I don't want to be filming. <laughs> what do you do? You film me. Do you want to do a tour? A, a uh, gaming tour? No. Do you know how to work this yet? Yeah, I know how to work my computer. <laughs> no, this? Yeah, no, no, you don't. Somebody wants to know what guild you're in? I'm not in a guild. Oh, you're not in a guild? Oh, okay. Man. Even I'm in a guild. What time do you want to leave? We have to leave now. Right, I just asked you what time would you like to leave? Right now. 12.44. Let's go. Log out. Log out. I'm not kidding, because you can't wear that. Jarvis is really busy, so... Um... <laughs> we are. Oh my god. Oh, I'm tired. Woohoo. We're going to my parents' house because my dad said he's cooking us a vegan meal. So, we love when people cook for us. He's making spaghetti and meatballs. Spaghetti. <laughs> I just realized that I'm not very good at vlogging. We're just gonna watch like a football game, I guess, because we don't have cable. <laughs> the luxuries in life. Um, there he is. There he is. Oh my god, he's so annoying. Hi, sweet pea. Hi, sweet pea. You're so tired from running around. Boo had the zoomies this morning. How are you doing? <gasps> you little brat. Get ready. It's literally 12.50. You don't listen. I will follow you around until you get ready. Dude, what are you doing? Oh, <laughs> na, na, na. Oh, na, na. Oh. <laughs> Jarvis is in a TikTok phase. Should I tell them about that or no? Dude, why does it look like you're wearing a thong? I'm not. 
<laughs> it looks like you are. Keep it up. <laughs> Those are my favorite pajamas. Well, anyway, Boo had the zoomies this morning, so he's really tired now. And the zoomies are when you run around crazily for no reason at all. Right, Boo? I got the name the zoomies because from my favorite golden retriever account on Instagram. It's called Oatmeal the Golden. And it's hilarious because <laughs> the owner takes like a lot of videos of Oatmeal the Golden Retriever. And <laughs> she's like running around like so crazy. You know how dogs run around so crazy in the yard? And <laughs> she's like, oh, Oatmeal Oats has the zoomies again. <laughs> but that's what Boo has when he's running up the stairs attacking me. What? Jumping out of me, he's got the zoomies, so now I call him the zoomies. And that little guy right there? Yeah. He doesn't attack. He, no, he's mean. Boo, you're mean. You are you have multiple personalities because you're very sweet sometimes, but you're really mean. You're also the meanest cat I ever met. How can that be? Also, Boo has been uh, hiking up our water bill because he has started this new thing where he sits in front of the sink like he wants me to turn the sink on. I've been putting it on my Instagram stories, but I'll turn the sink on and he like, he'll ha he plays in it for about a half an hour until I actually turn it off. So my water bill, I'm just like waiting for it. It's just gonna be, it's like impending doom. That's how I feel about it. So yeah, he's ruining my life, no big deal. Dude, you left the light on in here. Okay, we gotta go or else. I hope you're not sitting at your computer. <gasps> Get away from your computer. Okay, sorry, I was about to put the skull in there. I guess I'll do it later. Were you? Wait, were you actually? No, yeah, you, you weren't. You lie. You lie. Why lie about? Why lie about that? Okay, we really gotta go, or else. Are you bringing your laptop? Bring yours. Yeah. Are you bringing your charger? How long are you gonna be there? Maybe like. Oh yeah, you're right. I probably should bring it. How long? Like, probably two hours. What did I say? <laughs> oh my god. I wonder if they sell men's stuff at Sephora. Like, men's shaving cream and like, really good stuff. I don't men's shaving cream. And like, aftershave gel. Remember when I bought you that... <laughs> oh my god. Remember when I bought you that aftershave uh, gel this from... This is the dullest razor I've ever used in my life. Wait, do you remember when I bought you the aftershave gel from the dollar store? Yeah, you threw it away and I was using it. No, it was no. That was the one that was really bad, and it smelled like a, I, I a grandma. It. it smelled like an actual dead I didn't grandma. Care and I was using it. You threw it away. Really? Mm -hmm. You were using it? Yeah, I used it every day. You used it every day? Mm-hmm. Oh, you should have worn your nice clothes that I bought you from George's. <laughs> you were giving me a paper towel. For what? You gave me a paper towel. Did somebody cut themselves? <gasps> oh! <laughs> he just locked the door behind me. He tricked me. That's, that is rude even for you. Guess who's back, back through the other door. <laughs> like it's morning though. Mm. We're making breakfast. Wait, look how dark it is. That's scary. It's to snow no, it's an apocalypse. It's to snow oh my god. This is the more this is literally 9 a.m. you guys. What the fuck? <gasps> Wait, I gotta show him his new collar first. Boo! Where's my little gentleman? Kind of looks like a girl. Can I throw this in the pot? Yeah, throw it in. There's his new collar. He's from the Dollar Tree. We love the Dollar Tree! Yay! We love the Dollar Tree. I was telling Jarvis that we should just buy like the minced garlic that comes like already minced, you know? And he's like, oh no, I, I literally just like throw whole things of garlic in my in my chili that I eat at school. Jarvis has been bringing chili to school. Um, like literally 
full Tupperwares of chili because he's like on this new weird health kick and he has very strange eating habits. But bringing an entire, he makes like the chili at night and I'm like, what are you doing? Like, what are you putting in that? He's like, oh, beans. He's putting whole, <laughs> he's putting whole cloves of garlic in the chili and bringing it to school and eating it <laughs> next to, like you're a menace to all the other students. What do you have to say for yourself? Garlic's super good for you. It's super good for your breath. It's a super good way to not make any friends at school. That's weird. By eating a, an weird. entire tub of chili That's weird with garlic, no, whole garlic. Girls. So yeah, we're the perfect couple today making breakfast together. We're making tofu scramble for Jarvis. His, that was what he requested today and I love to cook. So I was on board. There it is, folks. That looks really good. Mm-hmm. Hopefully it doesn't taste like ass. Let's actually, let's get the first taste on cam. Oh, hot sauce. You should get some bacon in it too, though. Pretty good. Like the worst reaction ever. Me. <laughs> really love this bacon. ASMR bacon, dude. It it literally doesn't taste good unless it's that crunchy. <laughs> Just mark my words. Does it taste like egg? All right, we're eating. <laughs> Just got back from the Dollar Tree. You guys are gonna think I'm nuts. My camera's dying. Uh, Cause I haven't charged it <laughs> in like two months probably. Uh, that's not true. But yeah, so I just went to the Dollar Tree because I have decided that I want to organize my entire like apartment. Um, and I was like, I was watching like Dollar Tree videos and I don't know, I just wanted to organize. So yesterday I went to Dollar Tree and I organized like my whole uh, drawer, which I'll show you. I'm just gonna show you what stuff I get and I'll try to film like me organizing stuff a little bit. And then I'll definitely show you the final result because I decided that like, so I, I did my closet like probably a month ago and it like, it was like, oh my God, I love this. Like I walked by it every time. And then I, now that I organized my drawer in my uh, laundry room, it's like, oh my God, like I love it, you know? So uh, I got a bunch of stuff yesterday, like, you know, weird stuff. But today I got like only organization stuff and it cost me only $30. Like to organize my entire apartment for 30 bucks, I'm even gonna organize my pantry because I cannot stand it. Um, so yeah, it was, look at this, three bucks. So I got a bunch of these because I feel like they look very like nice. Um, I wish they had more black ones, but I got some of these too and I can kind of like balance the colors out. Hold on, I got another one. Yeah. So yeah, I really like the black. I got all the black yesterday. Like I bought their entire stock of the black. And um, then I got these brown ones too. So I kind of like, they all look kind of nice together, if you know what I mean. So uh, I got a bunch of those. And then I got these for my drawers. They're really nice and they're just like metal um, black organ like things and they have little sections in them. Um, I got this for Boo's cat food because I don't like the way that his, uh, like the packaging looks. <laughs> You guys, I'm nuts. I'm telling you, I am nuts. I don't like the way that like spices look. I'll show you that in a second too, but I don't like the way spices, like all these different spice containers look. So I bought a spice organizer and I individually filled and labeled all of them because it just was driving me nuts. Like I couldn't look at all of these different spice labels anymore and sizes and I was just like, oh no. So that changed my life. Um, I got these for my drawers and they're nice because they have like a rubber lining. So 
that's good. Yesterday I bought a mat, which I'll show you too today. I'm just gonna show you like all the stuff I'm doing. Uh, yeah, so this is like to hold the mat down. It's like one of those non-slip rug things. And then I found these as I was walking through. I just thought they were really cute. You can see like all the um, sparkle in them and they're like those really nice socks, but there was, there was literally like only one. I'm like, what the heck? I feel like I stumbled on. They just remind me of like, I don't know, something cool. So um, I got these, which are a huge find by the way. If you need stuff like this, I would definitely go to the Dollar Tree. So like they're the, they're the big size of those like cloth, like, or not cloth, like fabric organizers, like the square ones. Um, and I bought these at Target, or yeah, it was Target for $5 a pop, and they're literally like the same thing as this. And I mean, the ones from Target I got are a little cuter, but not by much. So these get at the Dollar Tree for sure. They're a pretty good size. Um, and then finally I got a bunch of these baskets. So I got, this one with like the holes in it. I got this square one. These were the only white ones that they had. Um, and then I got this big one for obviously like bigger stuff. So I'm gonna put stuff like under my sink. Um, it's gonna be a day. So I'm gonna start like taking the tags off all this stuff. I'm gonna start organizing and then um, let my camera charge a little bit and then I'll bring you back in show you the progress I've made, and yeah, it's just gonna be a really hoot and holler and day. <laughs> this time don't hesitate, run away. Baby, don't lie and say I'm good for you, too good for you. Tell me either way, what's going on? took me an hour but it technically took me all day so let's start with the first drawer so I have organized these these are my Dollar Tree little things I bought these um, rubber bands I have a little I don't even know what that is um, hand sanitizer and then some super glue I have my pens pencils everything in here some binder clips over here I have some multi-purpose clips right here um, batteries I have just some gum, <laughs> more hand sanitizer, and this is where I keep my scissors. It's driving me nuts that this doesn't fit perfectly in there, but whatever. Um, I have my notebook that I write like grocery list, and then I have my paperclip cup. And this, I put um, like the rug stuff underneath it, so these don't slide around, this doesn't slide around, and the notebook doesn't slide around. So. That's a good tip if you just wanna get the Dollar Tree like rug stoppers, then that works pretty well. Didn't organize dra that drawer, but it's already organized. Um, this one I did organize, so I just have this thingy, I have my sunglasses. I need to get more rug stoppers underneath. You can see I have one right here, but it's not working that well. Um, but yeah, I just have two lighters. This lighter I got at the Dollar Tree yesterday, and it's so, Good. So yeah, I just have everything there in my folder, and yeah, and White Castle sent me this. Thanks so much. Okay, so that's that. Um, under here, I don't think I did much. 
I put two, nah, I don't really do anything. Okay, so pantry. Most people don't organize their pantry. I'm probably one of the only people. <sighs> but I just had to do it. So I have my cereal um, and rice up there. And I eventually I want to get like those containers because I really don't like the way that that looks. Like different size, like different, I don't know. I just don't like the way it looks. Like I like to be able to see stuff. So anyway, whatever. Um, and then I bought these. So then these are from obviously the Dollar Tree, as everybody knows. But I have like the oats. I have like I emptied out stuff and like so these like fruit snacks I put in there. Different stuff, you know what I mean. So I alternated like the colors because <laughs> I'm nuts. But I have like this stuff all in there. I have all of that in there. Obviously I couldn't fit all the cans, but that's okay. Down there, I have some like arts and crafts stuff right here, which is like, it shouldn't be my pantry, but whatever. Um, so yeah, that's what my pantry looks like. Let me just step all the way back. It just makes me so happy that everything's in order. Oh my God, I, I should have take, I should have taken pictures beforehand, but um, this isn't that organized. It's just like nothing special. I did put this in here, which has my like coffee stuff in it. It's like my Nespresso pods and, um, like hot chocolate and I have like latte things that I can like make designs and stuff. So um, yeah, I just have stuff in there. Um, okay, so come over here. This isn't really that organized. I just kind of like got everything in order. Like I didn't put anything in there, but that's our coffee thing because it's right above the coffee maker. Um, this drawer has always been pretty organized or this cabinet because, you know, pretty easy. But this is the one that I'm very proud of, okay? So I have all of my little baskets in there and I just love how these fit perfectly in here. So I have like all the stuff that I don't really use that much. So like flour, um, egg replacement, cornmeal, sugar. This is my spice organizer, which I'll link. Uh, I got it from Amazon and it comes with these little like um, labels. I put my tofu press and just a couple things in here like the uh, our Ziploc containers and then I have like stuff that I use pretty frequently but like doesn't go in there so like these grinders I also got these at the Dollar Tree I freaking love them it's a sea salt grinder and then like, black pepper grinder and then I have like nutritional yeast which um, like these are all filled like every single one so I don't have any room but um, yeah I have just like just my, just use the use. So anyway, let me step back really quick again. That's that cabinet. Um, I did organize down here. <laughs> this is insane. And then I put, I had an extra one of those and like I just didn't want, I had like a bunch of spices in there, like leftover stuff. So I just didn't want it to be seen. So I put it in there. And then I took all of our water bottles out because we just like leave them right here and then we quickly put them in our fridge. So um, yeah, and then there's just that cabinet. And yeah. Okay, so let's go over here. This, this is our laundry room. So we just have some stuff up there. I have like Boo's food, so he can't get to it. Um, I have just like laundry stuff, and then this is like his little cat stuff. So the Dollar Tree has the very best collars ever. They're like glitter, and Boo loves them. I take all the bells off because they bother him, but um, like they have every single color, like blue, he used to have blue on, he has, this is what he's going to wear in, um, for the holidays, I can't, wait, is this orange? Tell me this is not orange. Okay, I don't know if that's orange or not, but he's wearing this for the, the holiday season, okay? Jarvis got him this one, I hate it, but, um, like the glitter ones are really, really good, and then, again, like I get these little toys, and he really likes them, so. Um, yeah, so that's like his little cat box of his little things that he likes. So, yeah, excited about that. That's the food thing, and you know what I mean, you know what I mean. So, moving along, let's move over here. I hate these because they're like those pull open doors. Um, okay, so we're in the bathroom. So, up there, I use the two white ones, and then this is all the makeup I'm donating. I have just this like thingy over here, but these are the two Dollar Tree organizers. Again, there's makeup in there that I need to donate. And then that's like my bath travel stuff. And then I put this right here, has all of our towels in it. I just like rolled them kind of haphazardly. But um, 
our other towels right here, and then we have our toolbox. I have my cat litter, Ziploc bags because I put his poop in there. And then I have potty training pads which I put around just so, because he tends to miss. So we put his cat box in here which is nice, but like he can see perfectly well where he goes. He's got, it's like kind of like a private space, but it's also in the bathroom. So like the smells that come out of there are not foreign. <laughs> Um, but like if somebody comes over, we can just kind of like shut it like that. So nobody has to see his cat box because we live in a one bedroom. So, um, I have like a little litter tray and then he has all of his stuff and I had to get a rimmed one because again, he misses a lot and he did it at our last place in, um, there's the criminal. Anyway, here's our stuff down here. So this is just underneath the sink. I have like my uh, self tanning stuff. I have a bunch of bath stuff like tampons, pads, like bath salts, um, stuff like that. And I have my cleaning stuff back there. And then I have my, um, this is Jarvis's stuff, which he likes to keep underneath the sink for some reason. I don't know why, but yeah. And then all of that. I'm pretty happy about that because that used to be really bad. And then this is a really huge difference. So um, just some, Random stuff like my blow dryer and all that. So, boop. Get the heck out of here. Okay. And then I have this stuff right here, which is just, you know. I put, again, I put that rug stopper so none of this stuff slides around when I um, pull it out. But, yeah, it kind of works nice. That was, like, such a messy drawer, I can't even tell you. But I forgot to show you. Oh, let me just show you underneath my sink because I did organize that. This is a huge difference. So, um, yeah, just put my cleaning stuff and like dish stuff and then I put my towels and then like some extra soap in there. And I have like a little basket I already had before which just has like miscellaneous. I put my paper towels and then those lemons I use, um, when it's not the holidays to decorate. So, the last place, coming over here, what are you doing? Okay. Last place, um, this is just a little like upgrade that I made so it used to be such a disaster up there and now they have like look at those those are a dollar and like over here see these in my closet I paid like five or six dollars for each one of those and they're not that much different you know these are the same size um so yeah I just have like all that stuff so it kind of looks a lot better now oh my god thank god um and we have our like laundry and stuff that's where we put it so Woo, that was a long one. Um, so yeah, that was pretty fun. And I want to show you this too, sorry. I'm like hauling everything, but these are vegan candy that I bought for the, um, there's not gonna be trick-or-treaters because there's like barely anybody that lives in our, our apartment's like area. <laughs> but I was just like, oh, you know, I kind of miss being able to like eat candy. So I found this and I had to order it online, but it's really, really good, and it does taste really a lot. This is probably the best tasting vegan chocolate that I've had. A lot of time it's like really bitter or just gross, so yeah. If you wanna get it, I'll link that below too. It's called No Way, and I'm definitely gonna be ordering like their, they have like a lot of holiday stuff, so they have like Christmas stuff too, and um, unfortunately this probably won't go up by the time it's Halloween for you guys, so um, it definitely won't actually. But maybe like next year if you want to check that out or for Christmas if you want to check it out. I don't know. Okay. Okay. Um, so anyway, yeah, that's about it. I'm going to make dinner now and I will talk to you guys later. Bye. What's up, bros? Hey, boo. Here's my honey. There's my honey. There he is. You want to show him your collar? <gasps> Gorgeous glitter from the Dollar Tree. We love it. All right. There you go. Okay. So, just got back from the store again. Um, okay, let me just show you what. So, because the holidays are coming up, by the way, I had an idea the other day that I wanted to do, like, make a vegan Thanksgiving meal, like a, a one before Thanksgiving so you guys could see what recipes I use if in case you are vegan this year or if you want like a total vegan meal and like all the recipes and stuff like that. I just think it might be, I thought it might be a good idea 
Not sure how many people will be interested in it and it would be a lot of work, but if people want to see that, I feel like it would be helpful because I've kind of like looked that stuff up before and I'm like not really sure. So anyway, oh wait, I gotta, I have to give you an update. Hold on. This, this, okay. So fucking good. I don't, I think this is not new, but maybe it's like newer. This tastes exactly like vegan. I mean, this tastes exactly like Kraft mac and cheese. It's actually scary weird. And like the other day I added cheese to it and you don't even have to add cheese to it. Like that's just such a fatty thing for me to do. I honestly didn't even try it before I added cheese, but you do not need it. Like I made this yesterday and I'm obsessed. Like it was nostalgia times 25. Okay. So anyway, um, I got this because we're going to my, like, where was that photo? Excuse you. Who's on my counter? I mean, you know, I just gotta let him, I gotta let him live. So, boo. Oh, you wanted me in the shot. Oh, you wanted me in the shot. Okay. Um, he actually wants me to turn the sink on. That's what he wants. There you go. Okay, so he's doing the background. So we're going to my aunt's house for just like a family thing, but I'm supposed to bring like, I was like, what should I bring? And she's like, bring a dessert. So um, this is what I always bring. And like, I make this for Thanksgiving and I don't tell anybody that like I bought it because last year I brought it to Jarvis's family's house and I like didn't even say, they're like, oh, did you make this? I was like, yeah, <laughs> I did not make it. Um, but the Marie Callender's Dutch apple pie, it's literally like you are the best baker in the world. It's so freaking good. The crust, like the crunchy, like cinnamony crumble on top, so good. By the way, vegan, obviously. So, um, putting that in my freezer right now. Um, I'll show you that in a second. And then I just got a bunch of like other stuff you don't care about. But so anyway, I want to show you. Um, I don't know if I was going to, I'm going to do like a apartment tour. I kind of need people to request it because I already did like an empty one, but now that it's totally done, now that it's totally, okay. Um, now that it's totally done, I don't know if you guys want to see like a full one right now it's decorated for fall, but, um, yeah, it's like done, done. Like no, there is nothing else that I need to do. So I do want to show you quickly though. This is so cool. Um, this, what's it called? It's a, uh, like a coat rack or whatever for a small, like a small entryway. So it matches my four floor perfectly and my kitchen because like all the black, but this is where we now put our shoes because look at down there. It is so small down there. I can't even tell you. Okay. I don't know where you're going, but it's so small down there, so this is like the perfect solution. And if you live in a small apartment, I just, I can't even say. So anyway, I was reached out to by like a company. It's not sponsored, but they did send me this and I think they're gonna give me a code. So I'm gonna link that down below. But this is like super cheap too. I think it's only like seven, 60 or $70, but, um, and with the code, I don't know what it'll be, but I put these lights around it from Ikea. And I have like a little bowl right here that we had for Halloween, which is so cute. I think I got this in the Target dollar section a few years ago. And then I put these little erasers at the bottom. So it's just, it doesn't like, you know, make a, a loud noise. But um, we just put our keys in there. He puts his wallet. And I leave like my purses on here. And I, I got this at the Dollar Tree, which I think I showed you guys already. But... I hang my coats. He doesn't really hang his coat here because he just doesn't hang things up. Um, that's just how guys are. But um, Sunglasses and it's got like all these hooks, which this was so easy to put together. If you have ever put together Ikea furniture, um, then you know how difficult sometimes these things can be. So um, yeah, this you assemble yourself, but it literally probably took me like 30 minutes and everything is like labeled and like all the little pieces are labeled perfectly. So it's super easy, but yeah, like, is this not the cutest thing ever? So anyway, I think it's in stock. I'm going to link it below. And then I got another one. I'm going to show. Let me plug it in. Okay. Then we have, I have this, which is brand new also from same company. And I will have a discount code for it. But this, oh my freaking God, dude, this is what you see in the background of my videos sometimes if I film in here, which I rarely ever do. But, um, is he just following me into every room? Jesus. 
Um, but yeah, this is same style, like the same wood. Love it. Look at that. Like, so cool. I did the same Ikea lights, and then it's just kind of like gets bigger towards the end. But I like it because we can put our printer down there. Before I had it like shoved in our closet, and every time we'd have to get it out. Um, we keep our internet thing right there, and it's just so freaking cute. Uh, excuse me. So, yeah, I'm going to have that link down below. I think this one's even less expensive than that one is, but um, I freaking, like, I freaking love it. It is so freaking cute. This would be cute. Um, it's just very expensive looking without being expensive, so I'm going to link it down below. And you guys should chop it because... That like both of those things changed my life and I'm not kidding like they really changed my life and I feel like they really made our um like if you live in a small apartment those are key like when we moved to New York those are coming with us when we moved to New York because it's gonna happen okay okay I'm making lunch and then I'm just going on with my life I don't know